Good morning. I look terrible. It's like really early. I got woke up at 3, 3, 3. But it's about 4 something now because I had a coffee. If you haven't been here before, don't look at the teeth. Look, I haven't even brushed them yet. I was just guided on it. And um, I hope you're okay. I'm half asleep, babes. I've put some music on for you. Some copyright free. <laughs> um... Indian, not Indian, I think it's flute music, but it's Amer Native American healing music. I found some copyright stuff because um, I miss having not having my music on. Sorry, I am half asleep, even though I've been up about half an hour. I was sitting there thinking, what should I do? And I was, all I got in my head was, you need to go on. But I feel this is going to be a quiet read for some reason, like more about you. I know some people like the karmic reads because you want to hear about the other person, didn't you? Because you know about you. But, um, yeah, I can't be too loud because obviously my dogs will sleep in the living room. And I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't know what we're doing here. I don't know. So, good morning. And we'll just see. My hand's itching, so we are on our way. Angels and ancestors come in my space and guide me because I really don't know what cards to do I shuffled these ones my nose is itching my angels are coming in I'm getting energy guys give me a minute <coughs> my angels are with me all the time but obviously when I'm reading I'll get different angels come in or yours or whatever guides you've got I get guided by your ancestors and mine and your angels some of them are your angels the lighting in here is terrible it's making me look a bit yellow but um Give me a minute, I'm going to put that light on. Sorry guys, because it's a bit, the light's a bit crap. That's probably a bit better. Probably it's a little bit better. Yeah, I only made my bed. Look at my knees, while I keep falling over, my dog pulls me over. <laughs> Seriously. I got an XL bully, if you haven't seen me before. He's massive and he's always pulling me over. He was so naughty last night. I kept on, because I can't let him off the lead, it's against the law in um, England. So he, he kept looking at me like this, and I, I'm getting used to him now, because I've only had him probably nearly a year, probably not even that, to be honest. No, I haven't. I got him in, I think it was October, and um, yeah, he looked at me, and I thought, why are you looking at me like that? And now I know why he looks at me like that, because he's got lovely eyes, and he looked at me like that, and then he went and bolted. Well, I bolted with him. I go flying, he pulls me over because he tries to spin, but he wants to run, bless him. So anyway, that's enough about us. <laughs> it is real weird if you haven't been here before. I'm normally a lot louder than this, but I have just woken up, like I said, so I am quite quiet when I wake up. But I'm guided on, so I'm going to use... You're using your strength at the moment and your discernment. You've got a golden future ahead of you. You really have. You could be coming into a lot of money and abundance. And like you've gone really higher up in your purpose. You've trusted in the Lord with everything you've got. And you believed that you will do this. So you are doing this. The Lord or the universe is showing you which path to take. That's why you're moving so boldly. And you have got a golden future. You have. You've got a golden future ahead of you. I think you're very high up now in the realm. Like as the angel that you are. You're like more than an earth angel. Yeah, you're very strong, but you, you use a lot of love. Like as your strength is your love, and it is. And you're not trying to win at all. All you want to do is like help people. Like you don't need the approval of people either. If pleasing people was your goal, you would not be in your full purpose. And you like, I feel whoever's watching me, you serve God. Like as in you do everything that you feel you've been asked to do. Any download you get as you, as an earth angel, male or female, doesn't matter here. I feel that 
you could be a water sign as well or an air sign there's a little bit of fire in here as well you could be any sign to me because i don't do signs but it's what i'm feeling as you watching me but then i'm getting all signs air earth water and fire so you could i think this is for anybody to be honest i only say the signs because you like them but yeah if pleasing people like was your job like your goal in life then you wouldn't be doing what you wanted to do mm. look at that card isn't it lovely you might live by the water or you might look up at the sky like you might have seen the northern lights as well you could live near the northern lights because that's what i'm getting off that but yeah you're just really loving and strong moving boldly in life now because you're going towards a really good future you are that's lovely so it's not energy i'm just burping so i've had a coffee i look so rough i'm so sorry but this is about you not about me i do feel like i'm getting energy actually i don't want to do you a karmic read though this morning because yesterday i did you a read and not because of the read but um i was so tired yesterday i don't know why i think my b12's going because i can't produce my own b12 because of my ex and i'm so tired lately i fell asleep me and the dogs fell asleep i woke up took my dog for a walk this might resonate with you it normally does when i talk about myself and um i didn't stop sleeping yesterday and i do sleep a lot because i've had 45 years of trauma so my body needs to rest because once you've healed your head your body feels safe to rest i put a post up about that whoa there we go we've got jesus we love jesus <clears throat> Yeah, you've become a lot more still now. I think because you're listening more to your guides and God. Yeah, I feel like you do love life at the moment. Like, you like insects and um, you just like anything that's alive. Like, you like feeling water. There's a lot of water in this car, so you could be a Pisces, but you might just like water, like feeling water. I just think you just love everything. You love human beings. You love, like, the earth. Maybe you work to do something to help the world. Because I've got a lot of world colours in this card. Like, you're an earth angel. I feel like you are an earth angel, definitely. You could like swimming in the water or just being in the rain. Maybe you like going out for walks when it's raining. But I think you like to be out. In places that are quite still because you feel God more or your angels whatever you believe in but you feel like there's life is in every little thing that touches your hand that's what you feel like you do right let's have a look at these cards look at them aren't they lovely so look at the water around you see all the water around and look at the colour, very earthly, aren't they? Very, very earthly colours. Yeah, pure, unconditional love. So you know, like, it says, speak to the earth and it will instruct you. Let the fish in the sea speak to you. So you basically are just, you have unconditional love. I think you find everything speaks to you. You understand everything like the earth. You might be into saving like the planet and doing stuff just in general to save i was going to say the human race because you might just care about human beings jesus watches over you you are the lamb that no, he's holding the lamb or the goat it's a little lamb though pure and unconditional love I think that's what you are. You are just pure and unconditional love. Yeah, now you're going to embrace your life now. You are. The kingdom of heaven belongs to you now. So you, you've you done a lot of work on yourself and you're getting blessings coming down from the universe and your angels, they send you so much love. You're a healer as well. You are a healer, definitely. Because I can see, I can feel it from the purple. There's a lot of purple and green in this card. 
you're definitely in your full like you believe and you talk to the universe all the time you get downloads all the time you could have really healing hands like your hands be careful who you touch with your hands because i feel from that gold card we had before i put it away now whatever you touch turns to gold be careful what you touch though because you don't want to give your power away to other people i'm feeling quite strongly on that because i feel that people around you get very like gifted and very um they become an abundance around you so be careful who you're hugging and who you're touching keep your energy to yourself like embrace like the adventure in your life as it says here but remember that these blessings are for you to help other people but not to take your blessings i'm getting guided to say yeah you've got a place in heaven and you have You might feel a bit more like, um, not a child, but you've gone back to your childlike ways where you feel free and you feel happy, you feel giggly and you just you just feel free and you've got so much love from the divine. You might even look up at the stars, but you've definitely got healing hands, definitely. You might love the colour green or purple, but green is very calming. Purple's normally very healing and you really look at the hands, look look you've definitely got healing and you've got love around you you have a lot of love around you yeah you're expressing yourself more now i feel like you're getting back into either more hobbies or you just feel like more things are coming to you that you like that you probably didn't know that you liked so you might be dancing more, like playing instruments. I feel like you like playing instruments. You definitely are a creator. You're creating yourself. You're actually like turning yourself into the person that you want to be. Maybe you didn't even know who you wanted to be. There's a lot of purple around you. A lot of purple. But look, the instruments, look. It says that about creating... Praise his name with dancing, accompanied by tambourine and harp. So some of you are really into your music, or you feel musical. You might feel like dancing around. Dance around. Do you know what? I so want a tambourine. I am going to order one. I've wanted a tambourine for ages. I've been guided to get a tambourine. Yeah, so you obviously are dancing, instrumental, very creative person you are. Right, so I'm going to give these a little shot. Oh, told you I didn't know where I was going with this, but obviously you needed it. I wish I'd cleaned my teeth. Less. When I drink coffee, it makes my teeth yellow. My teeth are terrible. If you haven't seen me before, I got drugged by my ex and his lovely um, girlfriend. They were um, lacing my drinks and my food for years. And um, my teeth just rotted and started falling out. And also the stress that they gave me. I have beautiful teeth and it does bother me and people say oh you shouldn't keep mentioning it but it bothers me and it does because the first thing if I got money I would get my teeth done I don't like fakeness but I would get my teeth done because I can't eat properly and I can't um, talk how I used to my bite doesn't align but yeah if you're wondering about my teeth and I do mention it because like I said it bothers me a lot because they ruined my teeth they just tried to ruin everything about me but it didn't work, not for long anyway. That's why I come on here about my teeth, because I've got a plate, but I'm not putting it in because it hurts. And I um, I always promote to you to be real. And what's happened to us is not our fault. Whether you've got scars or you've got little imperfections or big imperfections, don't worry about it. Embrace it, okay? Make it part of you. And I'm tingling all over saying this, because people tried to destroy me where I live, and I, I'm... Don't worry, they did. They did. Oh, yeah, they did. Till I fell on the throne, got, got up like a lion. And then I ended up on here because um, God gave me the strength to do this, to help other people with what I knew about life. Didn't think I really knew much, but apparently my life's quite exciting. <laughs> so I get told by my angels. I only tell you things because I want you to be real and I want you to embrace yourself. No matter what people do to damage you, just love yourself and be yourself. Don't let people win. Don't let people win, okay? I feel like I had to tell you that. Seriously. Right. Have faith, guys, okay? 
because now you're walking through new doors and you are your future looks so gorgeous for everything there is a season a time for every activity under heaven so you've got a lot of things coming to you you've got an absolutely beautiful future you are climbing like up the ladder so you're literally on your way more over to heaven 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 your main name might be heaven someone you know might be heather could be a, a guide that's named heather so heather's quite a heather so it's quite so i could have wanted to say then heaven like, like i was going to but it went into heather so you might have an angel called heather like a nan i'm feeling this is going to resonate with someone because i can see now this person like lavender i can smell lavender so you're on your way up. You might be guided by someone called Heather. Someone watching me, you might resonate with this because I, I really wanted to say heaven, but it was Heather. You're going up more, like the tears, more tears, higher. But you have got a beautiful future and you've got loads of angels around you protecting you and you have, and you're going to be very abundant. You could be of the same sex, I'm feeling, if like you wanted a relationship, whoever's watching me. But that's only for some, not a lot. You're going to be very abundant. You could be buying yourself, you're a woman, you could be buying yourself new dresses or you work with material. You could be moving to a bigger property as well. But you are literally, you have a place in the kingdom, in heaven, you do. And everything you're doing, you're stepping more towards that now. You're feeling very strong. You've got a lot of support behind you from your angels. I can feel it. I really can. That's why you're going to be abundant. You just, you just got a beautiful future. Have faith that you have as well, because you are. You're going to walk in places that I think you didn't think that you could walk in before. You are. You are. Look at that card. Look. Look at the stairway. Look to heaven. And that's also probably where you're going in life. I feel like someone watching me was a little bit like Cinderella and you had a few ugly sisters around you. Yeah. So you might find your prince, someone who's just like you, who is musical, I feel. Maybe a healer like you. They might heal you, someone, if you find, if you want a relationship. I feel this is a bit of a Cinderella story. She's reminding me of Cinderella. I do feel like you may have had some ugly sisters around you. You know what I mean, like, as the story, like, thinking you was beneath them because they was a bit not as beautiful as you, if you know what I mean, inside and out, not just looks-wise. I really feel this on that card. There might have been a Cinderella moment. Yes, I do. Right, guys, let's have a look at this. Sorry I'm a bit quiet, but it's very early, and I've got a little boy downstairs underneath me, and I don't want to wake him up because i've got a very deep voice and i do get louder on it i do but i love you all and i do and thanks for coming here but sometimes i'm guiding on here going ninny guided on here for a reason i've got angels around me because my ears are buzzing guys but this will resonate with, with some of you it may be not always resonate with all of you because i'm always different every time oh ask right you need to ask your angels for help, okay, in any situation. And they will immediately go to work on your behalf, okay? So some of you might need to ask if you're a little bit stuck. Maybe you're new to this, um, like what you're doing as an earth angel. You're like an apprentice, I just heard. Maybe you like the moon. You might feel like you get stuck more around the full moon maybe you feel like that's when you need assistance i'm feeling the angels have governed oh no sorry the angels are governed by many universal laws and among them is the free for let me start again i want to read the card right i don't want to read it i want to read it myself let me so i'm not going to actually because i feel you Around the full moon, I feel that you, like, probably struggle more with what you're supposed to do because you're a little earth angel. You're definitely an earth angel, definitely. But I feel like you're quite new to this. You might have, like, not struggle. 
I feel like you feel like if it's your own choices, you don't know if you're making the right choice on things that you do or things. Maybe you don't know if it's downloads or not. Like, is this my thoughts? Am I getting paranoid? Like, is this the angels talking to me? I think you're figuring out what what's what, if you know what I mean. I'm going to read you the card, but I don't feel like I want to. I want to read the card myself with my own um, intuition and angels. It says, this is from your angels, okay? Ask us to help you in this situation and we will immediately go to work on your behalf. We are governed by many universal laws and among them is the free will that allows you to make your own choices and decisions. So we patiently await your request. Yeah, I feel you don't... You don't really know if what you're hearing is like, is this my intuition? Is this my angels? And you're trying to work it out. Just go with it. Angels will guide you. It's natural to feel like that. I'm like that. Um, not so much now, because I. it took me about three years to work out what was my thoughts, what was my angels' thoughts, what was downloads. I don't always. I go with just, I relax and let the angels guide me. But um, I go by energy more, because I live by energy. So I feel that I definitely what I was saying before I read the card. I'm not in a reading mood. That's why I want to read the card. I've never read these cards like this. I feel, because I can, I can read an, a raindrop. I can read my top if I wanted to. I can read anything. I can read people. Piece of dust probably I could read. But yeah, I feel like you're quite new to this. Like, look, we've got the little child. And maybe around the full moon, you might feel a bit more like you are struggling. But just ask your angels, because you're learning. I feel like, like I said earlier, your little apprenticeship, you're, you're just little starting off on your um, journey on helping people on this earth to fix people. Like, not karmic-y people, like just fix people that need fixing, that won't drain your soul. I feel that quite strongly, but you are protected. And you've got to keep still. I think if you keep still, you will hear God talk to you, and you will. Because God is guiding you through like new doors to a new place. You're having a brand new future. It's going to be absolutely beautiful. Maybe if you play music, it might make you get more downloads and become more open to the universe. Because that's why I ring my bell and I dance a lot. Sometimes I dance with material and I swing around. And my angels love it apparently when I dance with material because ancestors like you dancing for them and they do they love it right let's see what else we've got what are we on so i'm not going to do these long videos or oh, that flip back over guys well you've got two here guys yeah you're going to be an entrepreneur you are you are you've climbed mountains to where you've come yeah entrepreneur yeah See, you're lighting the way for other people. You're, it's like you're lighting the torch. You know, like in the Olympic, not the Olympics we just had. That was just utterly disgusting. If you had a torch in your hand and there was a bit of darkness for other people, you're lit up now. But you're going to light the torch for other people to guide them to the way that you've gone, is what I'm getting. <clears throat> you could end up... Um, also, you could end up getting a job on your own, like being self-employed. It might suit you better, like working for yourself. I think it will help you like follow your own intuition and you might find it easier to stay with the divine rather than getting like a, a mainstream job. So it could mean that with the entrepreneur as well. But yeah, I feel that, um, yeah, I feel like you're going to have people around you, though, that you're going to actually try and help and light the way, show them the way. How did you climb these mountains? How did you get where you are now? Sorry, I'm getting lots of energy now off this card. Yeah, see, I think you're going to end up with people around you now that are going to remain loyal. Like, they're going to stick with you. They're going to stick by your side. So, obviously, you might not have had people around you that are very loyal. I feel that you're going to make new friends. But you're going to be the leader. So, rather than you being, like, the one that feels, like, less than, I feel, like you might have done before, now you're going to be the leader. You're going to lead the way. You're going to light the torch for people to follow you. Like, how you got where you got. How did you climb the mountains? How did you get out of the darkness? That's what I feel like. And we've got purple again. 
but yeah definitely and you are divided by like divine you've got a lot of guidance a lot of angels around you but you are going to be a people that could be more team players and they will remain loyal and they will stand by your side as well and they will also like ensure your success as well they will definitely i feel that a lot on there look at the mountains look You've climbed mountains and you've come out of the darkness, look, and now you've had to literally make your own fire, like light a torch. But now look at the size of your wings and look at the purple again. You're a healer. And you're definitely, definitely going to get people around you, you will, that make you feel more secure. Just make you feel safer. Like as in like building something around you, like a nice community. Yeah, I think, like it says on here, see yourself through the eyes of your angels. That's what you're going to do. You've got a lot of guidance from your angels. You have. They are going to guide you. But I think now you will accept that you know what to do now. And you're surrounded by love, guys. You are. Yeah, you inspire people. You lift everybody up to like their higher potential, and you do. So you make people feel like they're worth it. That's what, or if not, it's what you're going to do. Look. Look at all the angels, look. So much protection. I think you're feeling Irish on this card because I can see there, look, like two little leprechauns. You might live in Ireland. You might actually be Irish. I feel you see a lot of butterflies as well lately. You might believe in fairies, and fairies are very naughty. I feel you might have angels around you and fairies. So you live in the dark and the light. Because fairies can be very mischievous, yeah? And they can be quite naughty, and they can um, they can harm people as well, fairies. Because they're not all fluffy and light. But I love fairies, because fairies, like, they're sort of dark as well. So you might live in the dark and the light, whereas you're protected by, like, your demons love you, put it that way. Because you fought, when people say that your demons love you and people don't get it, it's so hard to explain. If you've had um, an awakening, you'll know that you was in a really dark place and you were fighting your demons forever and your demons tried to keep you down. Same way I can explain it. And you fought and fought and fought to get out of this darkness. And you were so strong and believed in it that your demons are proud of you. Because they love to keep people down. And they think you're weak and they laugh and growl. And But if demons, you beat your demons, they think, mm, good for you. <laughs> they, they do, because they know you're strong. So they might hang around and still look after you. Well, fairies are like that as well. And fairies like to do naughty things and that. And they do. And they can be quite... Um, I don't know, I just think you, you've got everything around you. Angels, fairies, you live on the dark, you live on the light. I'm feeling on here, someone watching me, you might have lost a couple of babies. And they're around you, and I'm getting that a lot on this card. You, like, they're in heaven. Like, you might have had a few miscarriages, or lost a couple of children. I'm feeling that, I have never felt that on this card before. And I feel they're happy in heaven. I feel like they didn't need to be here. They were just passing through. That's why I feel like they might be like miscarriages or young, young babies. So tell me if that resonates. Sorry if it's triggering you, but they're very happy in heaven. They weren't supposed to be on this earth. It was too, too cruel for them to be on this earth. I feel like so, someone watching me lost a couple of babies. But they're actually beautiful in heaven and happy and... It was too dark down here for them. I don't, this is what I'm getting downloaded as well off this card. But I'm feeling you could be Irish. Definitely. Someone might have auburn hair. Like the real Irish look. Like auburn hair, freckles. Yeah, I'm really feeling that off that card. And I am. Right, guys. I'm going to give you... It's on 29.22. This has been lovely, this read. Let me... I'm sorry if this doesn't resonate with you, but it will resonate with some of you. My reads are always different because it's how I'm guided. And my angels, are like your angels are here. They will guide you to me and they'll guide me to talk to you. So sometimes I think, shall I post this? But it's for someone. 
If it helps one of you, that's all that matters. Divine light. What did I tell you? This is going to confirm now about the read. This is confirmation. Divine light, okay? So, yeah. It says, I am an expression of love and I shine like the sun. My inner light is my strength and my treasure. My intuition guides me to discover the wonder and goodness of who I am. If that's not confirmation, what did I say? You know what you're thinking. If you're worried, thinking, oh, is it my intuition? Just go with it. You've got a lot of guidance, okay? You've got a lot of light around you. You are the light. Nah. You are the light. And you've got a lot of divine light showing you the way, okay? You are very protected, very, very protected. You are, except that you're protected, okay? You've got, look, angels, fairies, unicorns, everything is protecting you. You are an entrepreneur. You're going to find people around you, okay, that are going to work with you, stay loyal. Just be more like you. If you feel stuck or anything, ask the divine okay they're here to help you in any situation they will because they know you're just starting out in what you're doing and it can sometimes be a bit complicated all right just stay still be quiet ask god to help you or your angels all right maybe you need to sit by the water god sends you an unconditional love or jesus whatever you believe in okay they're looking after you look you're just gonna you're gonna be fine you are yeah, also speak to the earth, speak to trees, speak to the water, even the earth, the leaves, the wind, everything will instruct you what to do. Let the earth speak to you, let nature speak to you, speak to insects, see what you feel. I talk to insects all the time and animals, I know it sounds strange, but everything living is God and it is God is all around you because you do have faith now, have faith to walk through these doors, believe that you can walk through these doors and you are accepted in these places that you're going to end up going. You're like Cinderella, honestly. You're so like Cinderella, male or female. It's like a Cinderella story with you. You're going to have a lovely future. And just embrace life now and enjoy the adventure of life. The kingdom of heaven belongs to you. And act child, like childlike, not childish. And you are a healer. You've got a healing hand. You're getting so much love from the divine here. And play some instruments. Maybe that will help you express yourself more. Praise the Lord's name and dance. And just get your tambourine out or your guitar or play the piano, whatever. I feel you're quite musical. You might even be in a little band or <clears throat> maybe that's what you want to do. Right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to post this because it's for somebody. I think someone's just starting their full purpose and maybe you, um, not maybe, you are just the way I talk. <clears throat> I think you're in your full purpose. You might be questioning yourself a little bit. You might need a little bit of guidance. Are my angels around me? Sometimes they're very quiet and they leave you to do it. But they're still there. They're still there when you go to sleep. They're still there all the time protecting you. But sometimes they back off a bit and think, well, go on, do your stuff. Honestly, I know. And I'm tingling all over saying this. So know you're protected, know you're doing the right thing. Start believing in yourself a lot more, and believing in your intuition, believing in your guidance. Maybe it always feels like it's you that's guiding yourself. Well, it is, because your higher self's up there. So you've got to believe in yourself. That's your angels, yeah? It's believing in yourself, okay? I love you guys. I will do another video in a little bit. It's only done you one yesterday, and I'm sorry about that. But like I said, I was so tired. It wasn't the read. I just, I'm tired in general. But, um... Yeah, I love you, all right? And thank you. If you do like my videos, I do appreciate it because it does keep me moving. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. And um, I will look a bit better than this later. I put my eyebrows on for you, though. So, there you go. <laughs> I love you, guys. Thanks for coming to my channel. Mwah. Namaste, guys. I love you. Have a beautiful day, okay? You're doing all right. Trust me. And trust the angels. <laughs>